man, alien power. everybody how are y'all doing all right before we get started with this video you already know give it a thumbs up if you're here for that fire like all right bro this has been heating up the internet ces alienware has dropped a big bombshell in the gaming sphere they've turned a nintendo switch into a powerful pc kim thanks for subscribing if you're watching subscribe you'll see why at the end of this video but they are claiming alienware is saying this gives you the power of a gaming pc in handheld form and they have shamelessly, when I say shamelessly, copied the switch. The two joysticks at the side, they can be detached and attached. It even has a grip-like controller where you could detach the um, two side panels and put it into a grip like the um, Nintendo Switch grip and use it in that fashion. It has a kickstand in the back. Everything like a Nintendo Switch except for a couple things. The Switch has a 6 inch screen, this is a 10 inch screen, so it's a larger screen and it's thicker bro. It's, it's, it's thicker than a Switch and you can see the fan vents in the back of the handheld letting you know that this thing kicks out some power. Now, with the Switch Pro rumors, could this give us a glimpse? of what Nintendo could be cooking up with the Switch Pro because now a couple of things you have to keep in mind with this this was just a concept that Alienware showed off at CES this wasn't a product that they plan on shipping fall 2020 no a lot of times CES um, these companies they're, pitch, they're pitching their products to um, potential buyers could they be pitching this to the to Nintendo for a switch model in 2022 20, 24 because I have to say this this is going to be expensive this is going to be a pretty penny ain't no way in the world this is under a thousand dollars if it has powerful PC specs in a handheld form you're looking at at least a thousand dollars but one thing you have to look at with the price if they get a company say Nintendo to order it in bulk it will drastically reduce the price but I think Nintendo's always conscious of price and power the switch pro I don't think this is gonna it's gonna be as powerful as this like I said before, I think it's going to be around the PlayStation 4. PlayStation 4 Pro, the, well, really, this is probably PlayStation 4 Pro right here. So, <laughs> who knows, who knows. It's just hard to cram all that power into a, a small portable device. But, Switch Pro um, leaked rumor to be coming um, mid-2020, summer 2020. Um, it's said to be a premium um, a Nintendo Switch. The uh, more powerful PC um, CPU has been reported, and so I think perfect timing for Nintendo to release a more powerful system. This looks lit, bro. If I can get a powerful Nintendo console, I would be straight. And so Alienware's um, PC has been catching. Um, um, gamers attention but here's my biggest thing 
Dudes are like, I've seen dudes say, oh, this is going to destroy the Switch. Oh, Nintendo's Doom. This don't got Zelda. <laughs> it don't got Mario. It don't got Metroid. It don't got Super Smash Brothers. Ain't no Pokemon coming to this. Nintendo sells not because of their hardware. If it was because of their hardware, they would be tanking right now because they have the least powerful hardware on the market. It's the software, bro. Nintendo knows how to make great games. Nobody can touch their first party IPs. Um, and even their first party IPs, Nintendo knows how to maximize the hardware that's given to them. But uh, time will tell to see how this um, hardware sells. We'll see. All right, next news item. Overwatch 2 news, ladies and gentlemen. It looks like uh, the release window has been accidentally leaked by PlayStation. PlayStation um, um, Brazil's Twitter account. They recently tweeted about the game saying that the title will be releasing this year and that tweet has since been deleted. But the internet keeps everything. And so um, 2020 has been tweeted out as a launch date for Overwatch 2 according to PlayStation. Um, and just based on the gameplay and the footage that they've already revealed, this game is well in development. I think this is coming out in 2020. It looks like the game is running on the same engine as a previous Overwatch game. The art style is very similar, but a lot of new content and Switch owners. This has been confirmed for the Nintendo Switch with the Nintendo Switch Pro on the horizon. I don't have to second guess third party games anymore. <laughs> Thank you. But I have to say this, I'm enjoying Overwatch on the Switch. Even though it runs at 30 frames per second, which isn't ideal, it still gets the job done. I still have a blast playing the Overwatch with the sponsors. Um, and so Overwatch 2 coming to the Nintendo Switch looks like it's coming out in 2020. 2020 is shaping up to be super duper lit, bro. I mean, wow. 2020 is starting off with a bang games i can't wait for the next nintendo direct bro nintendo direct is gonna be lit Pla um as i reported yesterday capcom may have leaked the nintendo direct date either january 16th january 30th or february 13th mark your calendar for those three dates uh, for a nintendo direct next news item this is great news by platinum games they are saying that Astral Chain has exceeded their expectation in sales on the Nintendo Switch. Always great to hear um, third-party games selling good on the Switch. I slept on this game last year. I didn't pick it up, didn't play it. If I ever get through my backlog, I might eventually get to it, but my backlog is lit right now, bro. I beat two gems in Pokemon today. And so, a Pokemon, next game I got to beat, I got to play a Super Nintendo game, punch out something, Super Mario World, and then I'm going to tackle Fire Emblem and Dragon Quest XI. Come on, before Nintendo starts hitting us with games, 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 games. January, February, let it be a little light for me, bro, so I can play, beat some of these games. All right, dudes, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know, but before you go, Bro, I didn't do it, bro. This was for my last video. Click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out, bro. Dante, um, lit rumored to be the next Smash DLC fighter. We'll see. We out. You're still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I gotta hook you up. That's right. We're having monthly giveaways. $60 eShop codes for your Nintendo Switch. You can choose any game of your choice. How do you enter? One, subscribe. Make sure you're subscribed to this fire. Two, make sure you're following me on Twitter at Obi-Wan Plays. And that's it. You're in for our monthly giveaways. But that's not it. It gets even better. Do you want to game with your boy every day? Do you want to join our private Nintendo Switch Gaming Discord? Become a member. Three ways to join. One, through YouTube. There's a join button right below this video. It's two, through Twitch. 
Twitch Prime. You can do it for free or just subscribe through Twitch. And number three, the third way to join, patreon.com backslash ob1 plays you'll thank me later also check out the swag bro links are in the description see you later peace